Welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to tell you why and what supplements I use as a runner. Of course, I run quite a lot and I therefore demand quite a bit of my body. I use a lot of energy and I don't want to get in any deficit. It's one of the main reasons I use uh, supplements. I of course, try to get all my nutrients and vitamins from my food and I try to eat quite healthy, but still I choose, especially in the winter, to use some extra supplements. If you run or train only a few times a week and you already have a healthy diet, you don't need to use supplements per se. I train most weeks 10 times a week, so that's multiple times a day, and therefore uh, I don't want to get into any deficit. So what I want to say is, don't start with supplements per se without a good reason. Although here in the winter, for example, there's not much sunshine, so vitamin D is probably also for non-runners in general quite a safe bet. The last weeks here were pretty rainy. I also bought quite some fuel for the marathon distance. I'm going to make my debut in the Rotterdam Marathon in the fall of 2024. Recently, Calvin Kiftem also signed to this marathon to break the two hour barrier, he said. Well, I'm going to test and train with my nutrition and therefore I bought different fuel than I used to. But more about this at the end of the video. So what are my main reasons to use any supplements? The first one I already gave away is to avoid any energy deficit. You use a lot of energy, especially I, because I train and run a lot, and you need a lot of energy and nutrients. And some of the supplements I go over here uh, are pretty beneficial also for your energy, they give you a boost in energy as well as in your mood and mental health. The second one is also pretty important, especially in the winter uh, when there are quite some fevers going on here in the Netherlands and I want to avoid getting sick. So therefore I also use uh, some uh, supplements to boost my immune system. Several supplements are scientifically proven to boost uh, and maintain your immune system. And after a hard run or hard workout, your immune system is temporarily weakened because your body needs to recover from the hard workout. Supplements can help to avoid get sick and recover better. And that's the last reason why I use some supplements. They can really benefit your recovery and help to overcome muscle soreness. So those are the three main reasons I use supplements. So what supplements do I use? First, I use vitamin D. Vitamin D plays a crucial role in calcium absorption promoting bone health, and last, it supports muscle function and the immune system. Especially important to take in the winter when there's a lot of sunshine and you don't produce vitamin D yourself. In my vitamin D supplement, there's also magnesium. The magnesium, which has similar benefits. It's very important for recovery and proper muscle function. It's also well for maintaining good heart health. Your heart is also a muscle, of course. And I also use some omega-3 or fish oil. Also a supplement I take regularly. It promotes heart health and lung function. Besides, it's also good for your brain health and may contribute to good mood and cognitive function. And last, when I go on an altitude camp, I also use an iron supplement. Iron is a crucial component of hemoglobin, protein and red blood cells responsible for carrying oxygen. Supplementation of iron can support the increased demand for red blood cells at altitude. Well, like I mentioned in the start of the video, I'm also going to make a marathon debut in the fall and therefore I need to start training also with my energy intake. Not only with my energy output and running fast. Because if you don't take enough energy of course, you're not going to make it in to the finish line in a marathon. Well, I normally stick to the Martin gels, these ones. But I also heard quite a bit of good stories about the precision fuel. They're a little bit less expensive and come in 15 packs, quite handy. They also have the caffeine and the normal version, just like the Martins. Besides this, I bought, like I showed you in the video, quite some carb drink mixes and also some electrolyte tablets. Well, uh, I'm gonna use these as an extra addition to my uh, uh, marathon race fuel, especially the carb uh, drinks and my electrolytes or my hydration tablets, I'm going to use a bit for recovery. But I also bought some hydration tablets with caffeine in them. I think especially also the gels with caffeine or some electrolytes with caffeine can really benefit to stay sharp in the last part of the marathon. Although I have to start testing this. Coming quite a few videos online for a marathon project. It's gonna be a big project and I'm gonna aim for a fast marathon time. Probably somewhere around the SIP 280 marathon. 
Yeah, a sub 218. I recently ran a 66 minute half, so I think that's possible. Well, I hope you got some insight in this video why and what supplements I use, and I hope to see you again on the channel.